We're here today judging the 2017 Fragrance Foundation Awards in both male and female print ads and male and female commercials. And we've seen some really strong stuff, so very, very impressed. The vast differences and the production value it was incredible. Some of the adverts are just they're short films. So much emotional impact, so much beauty. It was really nice. Just the creativity, I think, and the fact that we're moving away from just um, a pretty girl's face or body. I think creativity is something that we all look for, um, you know, to be amazed or to be energised or sent someplace. And I think that, you know, quite a few of the, the entries this year have done that. Some of the print I thought were incredibly strong as a as a photo and as an image, I think there's a younger audience being definitely targeted and there's a lot, there's a lot of references to hashtags and to the Instagram generation. But some have also stayed very classic, so I find that really interesting. It's so difficult for a print ad ever to involve you like, um, like a commercial does. A commercial is movement, a commercial is depth, a commercial is music, a commercial is, you know, so many, so many levels. I guess what we're looking for is, is you know, just something that, that just, just focuses you and makes you look twice at it. These press ads have to do their, their work instantly. And the, 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 again, there's been some strong ones. Every marketing man would have a, a nightmare with something like that, but I think that's so brave. I think this year the, the female uh, commercials were, were extremely strong. Uh, we definitely had six you know, very fine examples. I've just been thrilled that the, especially the women's ads were much more impactful and interesting and more creative than they have been. I thought the female was far stronger this year just had so many that I loved. It was really hard. Actually, I don't think we decided until the very last minute. The male section was, in, in, in a sense, easier. There were some, there were some brave statements, there was some fun, there was some arrogance, and I think that threw up some interesting conversations. I think there's some great stuff yeah, in there. Good. It's impossible being head judge with uh, three people who are strongly opinionated. <laughs> if we are, and we have been, uh, deliberating about the finalists and the winners, um, all I can do is offer some guidance. It's just to offer a little bit of thought for the people that are generating this stuff. Who is it for? Why is it for? Sometimes a, a still image can tell a story and leave questions. It, it just yeah. stands out yeah. as an it stands out. I love the judging process. Lots of different opinions. It's been really fun. Yeah, I love it. I feel so fortunate to be a part of it. I love my fellow judges, they're incredibly smart, they're incredibly fast and very funny and very witty and they're very convincing. There were some difficult decisions, it, no it wasn't, a, it wasn't clean cut. There was difference of opinion, definitely, uh, we, we all have strong ideas. There were difficult decisions, the female print campaign, they were just all very, very strong. But I think in the end we all agreed and we picked the one that seemed fantastic.